Hey there, everybody. P.T. Pop here with all four lobes of my brain <laughs> securely bound behind my back. And today I'm going to liven it up a bit. I'm going to lighten things up a bit. And we're going to play with an AI app called Dream by Wombo. Stay tuned. Kayla Swift crapping her pants. She has a look of horror on her face as she realizes what's happening. <laughs> her pants are stained with brown feces as she looks extremely upset. Would you like fries with that? Would you like fries with that? So I have gotten into this whole AI thing lately, and I really get off on this new AI app called Dream, and it's by a company named Wombo. This is their website. If you go to dream.ai, you can download it there, or you can download it off of the, the App Store. I use iPhone, so I went to the App Store, and I got it from on my iPhone through the App Store. And you can either get the free version, or if you want to pay for it, it's $89.99 per year. You get a three-day free trial, or it's, it's $9.99 monthly, or for a lifetime, if you want to pay $169.99 forever, to use it forever. This is so much fun playing with this, because I put all kinds of crazy things into the app, and it creates pictures for you. This is text-generated, still Photographs are still visual creations or artistic creations. And I'll show it to you here. Bring up my phone. Now, this is where I keep it on my phone. I have a folder on my iPhone <clears throat> for AI stuff. And I click in the little W with the purple background. There's Dream. And it brings up the user interface. This is how it works. And I think this is so much fun. So you go down the bottom of the screen and you hit the plus sign at the very bottom of the screen. And up here, you type anything you want up here and you pick your size if you want it nine by 16 or like a short thumbnail or a square. You can do a square one, one by one. You can do 16 by nine or a thumbnail for like YouTube. I use this a lot to create my thumbnails <coughs> recently I'm doing on my thumbnails on YouTube. And it gives you examples of what you can put in here. You can put, you know, like they're giving examples, close up of the luminous shining monarch the night pixel art cart a uh, pixel art cart with flower pots unicorn skeleton in the middle of the green floor so on and so forth but i i've been doing funny things with it just to get to see what it'll do and i i did this one thing for taylor swift taylor swift crapping <laughs> her pants now the funny thing about this is if, if i scroll up down here there's like this little I guess it's like a magic wand, a purple magic wand. If you click on that, it'll it'll give you additional text to make your instructions more descriptive. I click on that, and it says, "Crapping your pants." She has a look of horror on her face as she realizes what's happening. <laughs> her pants are stained with brown feces as she looks extremely upset, and then. Put in upset and you, you hit return. You got to click the style. So it gives you a bunch of styles to choose from. Some of them are free. that They're they're included with the app. And some are premium that you pay extra for. But I always like to use Whimsical. See what they give me for Whimsical. Hit create. And I just did this one. Let's see if it'll let me do it. If it's too graphic, it'll kick it out and say you need to use Wombat. Or something weird like that. Now this this app is by a company called Wombo. It takes about a minute. So here we go. Here's the first one of with Britney Spears <laughs> grabbing her pants. Look at that. There's a little chocolate dinosaur over here. Let's see what it gives you. It gives you four examples of what it comes up with. I don't know what she's doing there. I think she's just looking upset. She's got a monster on her chest. I don't know what that's doing with crap in her pants. No idea. No idea what that one. But this one is the closest thing. It looks like she has a crap monster on her, on her pants with some uh, urine drops in the sky. Let's down. You can download it. You hit the download button, and you click on remove watermark. It'll remove the Wombo AI watermark, <clears throat> and it and it. You can get that if you pay extra. You pay you pay for having the watermark removed. But let's try another one here. Let's try um let's try a different a different style. Let's see if it gives me something. 
Let's try, uh, let's try horror. See what it comes up with. Horror. Britney. Now, did I say Britney Spears? I always confuse Britney Spears and Taylor Swift. <laughs> okay, that doesn't look like Taylor Swift crapping her pants. Taylor Swift sitting next to, it gave me Taylor Swift sitting next to a tornado in the Midwest. I guess she's crapping her pants. I don't know. Taylor Swift surfing. I guess she's surfing uh, on the West Coast. And there, I have no idea. So, so some of it works and some of it doesn't. It's pretty bizarre. <laughs> Joe Biden. Wearing adult diapers. Breathing. The immigrant caravan at the U. At the, see if I can type U. S. Border. U.S. Mexico border. What do we got? Well, he's not wearing Depends there. He's wearing an army backpack. No. These are no good. He's not wearing Depends there. Come on, people. Give me a different one. Let's let's try my my favorite. Let's go back to um, whimsical. Let's see what whimsical gives me. That's what she said. Oh, I don't know. It looks like he's uh, he's praising the Stay Puff Marshmallow Man there. <laughs> uh, I don't know what's going on there. He's talking to a pregnant woman. Here's, well, there's, there's a hoochie mama. Hoochie mama with some day glow green, green day glow pants. <laughs> I love this thing. I just enjoy this so much. Let's, let's try unicorn skeleton in the middle of green floor. This is the example they give us up here at the top. See what they give us with that. We'll choose a style. Another one of my favorites is the absurd. I love the absurd. Let's try that. Not doing it for me, dudes. Let's pick, let's pick some old actors from the from the, the eras gone by. Jimmy Stewart. And Harvey the Rabbit. Standing on a street corner. When I hit the little wand, it says Jimmy Stewart and Harvey the rabbit are standing on a street corner. Jimmy looks a little bit perplexed while Harvey just looks cute. I bet you just makes a regular rabbit. If you're not familiar with Jimmy Stewart and Harvey, it's a movie from like 1946 or 1950, but a guy that has an imaginary six foot tall rabbit. Well, none of those people look like Jimmy Stewart. So uh, that, 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 that that's close. Let, let's get rid of the, try a new style. I picked the absurd. I need to create a new style here. Let's pick up the whimsical one. There, there we go. There's Harvey. Look at that. Let, let's get rid of my head here. Harvey. I like that one. That's beautiful. Download that for me. Oh, well, it says Jimmy Stewart on the sign. It says Jimmy Stuari on the sign behind. But there's no Jimmy Stewart. They turned Jimmy Stewart into a rabbit. <laughs> well, I guess that's kind of that's kind of what I was looking for there. And then if you don't like the like I don't like this one. It just looks like three Bugs Bunnies. You can hit this button down here. It says regenerate, and it will regenerate just that one particular illustration. So it's text to illustration. Artificial intelligence here. There, there's Harvey. Now the rabbit's not not tall enough. Why don't I change? Why don't I change the words? Jimmy Stewart and Harvey, this six foot tall rabbit, six foot tall rabbit. We'll hit return and we'll go boom. See what it comes up with now. There we go. Well, it doesn't really look like Jimmy Stewart. Oh, he looks like Jimmy Stewart's fingering him in the butt. <laughs> well, Harvey, you've got your finger in my ass. What? 
That doesn't look like Stimmy Store. I like this one. I'm going to download this one. Harvey. Let's work with some of these others here. That looks like Bugs Bunny and Jimmy Store. Let's regenerate that one. There's Jimmy Stewart with Harvey. I took a picture of myself for an example to see what it would do with me. <clears throat> and I used the photograph of myself in the Dream app to see what it would do for myself. And I used this photograph of myself and I put it into the Dream app. And I input into the app itself, I put man sitting on his YouTube studio looking crazy and having fun. He has a wild look in his eyes and is laughing maniacally. He looks like he's enjoying himself immensely. Let's see what they came up with. This is hilarious with what they came up with. I, I can't wait to show this to you guys. I think it's hilarious. It's so funny. Boom. <laughs> Isn't it hilarious? Yeah, that's, that's me. They, they took my eyes. They gave me a wild look in my eyes. They took Oingo Boingo. What did they do to Oingo Boingo? They turned him into a pink Tasmanian devil. Oh, Oingo Boingo. He's no Tasmanian devil. Oh. And what did they do to the Beatles back there? They turned the Beatles into banana suckers. It looks like <clears throat> three of the Beatles, that would be uh, George, Paul, and Ringo are sucking on bananas or something. I don't know what they're doing. And they turned... Everything else in the background, I turned my painting of a dog into a one-eyed bear and my farmhouse into just an abstract piece of garbage. So that's, that's kind of the fun things you can do with it if you, if you want to put yourself in there. It's, I think it's a hilarious thing to do. It's a lot of fun. So check it out. You can download it on your app, your app store on iPhone or go right to Dream by Wombo. Go to uh, dream.ai, not Wombo. Go to dream.ai. I don't know if it's available for your PC or your Mac, but it is on your iPhone. So lots of fun. Like if you're sitting in an airport, take a picture of somebody, put it in here, turn them into a zombie. <laughs> All right. I'll be the Zane, baby. Have a good night. Bye. Would you like fries with that? Would you like fries with that?